These are the most expensive fish that I have ever bought, so I really hope that they get along. Fish spot number one. I think the mocha swarm that was here last week is still here, which means it is just meant to be. He was in here. Boom. That is our guy right there. Or girl, whatever it turns out to be. I don't think they got any more in, but let's see if any other clownfish are, uh, that yellow guy's pretty cool. I don't know what, what, what it is, but he's cool. Look how excited he is. He says, mommy, mommy, is that you? Hi, it's me. I'm here for you. Here we go. Oh, he's a fast one. Got him. Uh-oh, you got both. Sorry guys, I'm only taking one. <laughs> one down, one to go. He's so cool. I am so excited that he was still there for the same fish to be in a fish store for a week. It's like, not only that, but it's good that he was alive for a week. Now we have to get him a friend. Door number two. Oh no, man, don't get my fish. Is he still there? Is he still there? Oh, I think he's gone. Oh no, he's there, he's there, he's there, he's there. Whoa, look at this guy. That thing's cool. This clownfish apparently came in as an orange storm, but it looks very, very similar to a mocha storm. Maybe it was just wrong in as the wrong fish. Does this look like a mocha storm or an orange storm? Right here, what do we think? Orange storm or mocha storm? I feel like that is an orange storm. I really feel like this guy looks like the one we just picked out. The front of his mouth reminds me of a Furby. I'm gonna say that's a mocha storm. I know I don't know what I'm talking about, but he looks extremely similar to my other guy. I was also looking back at footage from picking up the Orchard Dotty back, and he was in the same tank. So I feel like it's just meant to be that we, we reunite them and put them back together, and hopefully they get along with their other homie from the other store. Mocha Storm or Orange Storm? Drop a comment right now. Let me know what you think. Time to start acclimating our babies. Fishy number one. Ooh. Fishy number two. I am so pumped for these guys to go in. I feel like they want to be friends already. Look at them. Keeties, keeties, keeties. This is the one that I got at Aquarium Show, which came in as the orange. I think that one's even darker than the Mocha Storm from Blue Seas. Meanwhile, the Orchard Dotty Back like hides for days. So hopefully we got these guys in in time so there isn't any territorial issues. Look at that front beak. Instantly reminds me of a Furby. We are gonna let you free in a bit. We're gonna have you swimming together in no time. I hope that they pair off and they get along nicely. I think that they are both from Pro Aquatics. I have to call and double check that, but I'm pretty sure they're both from Pro Aquatics, which could be good, you know? Maybe they even came in the same tank over there. Maybe we're reuniting them. $200 worth of fish might not seem like a lot of money to you guys, but to me, that is a lot of money. $100 of fish, like, I have never saw myself spending $100 of fish before, like ever. This guy is ready to just jump out of the bag already. He's excited to explore his new home. This guy, not so much. He's uh, in the corner, breathing a little heavy. He might need a little assistance. And we already have names for them. This little guy, we are gonna call Furby because right when I saw the beak on it, it just reminded me of a Furby. Kind of hard to see from this angle, but it looks like a little beak. My brother actually just named the one in the back. I didn't notice, but his bottom fins are all black. His are like half orange, half black on the bottom. So, we named him Captain Blackfin. And if you look at the top, he's got a, a top white uh, rim. So it's almost like he's got a captain's hat on. Let me know what we think of those, Furby and Captain Blackfin. This is the one that was brought in as an orange storm. And look at the coloring on that back one as well. I mean, they are very, very similar. I would say they're both mochas. Our dotty back is still nowhere to be found. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I just got the best idea. You know what I need right now while these guys finish acclimating? Can I get an iced cafe mocha, please? Woo! I usually get something completely different, but considering today's occasion, a mocha was necessary. This is actually kind of fire. I mean, do you guys see what I did here or, or no? Did this just go over everybody's head? I talked to the homies and they said they are ready to go free. So we're going to get this little guy into the tank first. Boop, 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 boop. Come on. Come on, I want to give you a better home. Got him. Got him. Got him. Woo-hoo! 
Yes, dude. Look at him in the tank. So sick. He's the perfect freaking size. Get this out of here. Whoa, whoa, this one's crazy. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, buddy. Come on, let's get you in here. Get you in here. Real quick. Oh, yes. Let's freaking go. So far, so good. Look at them already swimming together, baby. These came from the same tank at Pro Aquatics, I'm telling you right now. Look at them. They're freaking best friends already. Holy moly. I cannot believe that these guys are already swimming, like paired up together. This is insane. I am so pumped. They look amazing in the tank. No joke, they're freaking best friends. Furby's a little bit skittish, but I feel like that's normal. It's a new environment, still adapting. And uh, the Orchard Dottie back still hasn't come out to see what is going on. They are just touring the tank together and I absolutely love that for them. <laughs> Holy moly, did we get freaking lucky with these two. It is day two and I am so happy to report that the clownfish have made it through the night. I want to try to do a little feeding. I have some frozen mice that's left over from the other day. So let's see if we can get them to eat. They are just thriving. The dotty back was out this morning when the lights are off. For some reason, once the lights go on, he just disappears. This is the frozen mice we got. It almost looks like chopped garlic in there. A little of this. Oh, they're ready. Come on, guys. That's a lot. Look at them go. Those are some happy little clownfish. Meanwhile, the Dottie back still hasn't come out to eat anything. Captain Blackfin will probably become the bully of the two and turn into the female. Look how sporadic he is. He's just wild. It's hard to track him. Very, very fast and agile guy. I heard Glitch, look at him. I heard him ask for a little snack. They don't care anymore, they're out for the world to see. I feel like our Orchard Dottie back will eventually be a little bit more out and about, like Glitch, but it's just gonna take a minute. Corals that we put in here are still doing good, nice and fluffy. I think I'm gonna mount this A-can on the rock work somewhere. Just not sure where yet. Frozen mysis for everyone. Super happy to see that everybody's getting along so far and excited to see how they evolve in the tank. Hopefully with some more time, we'll see a little bit more of the dotty back. Maybe some corals will help soften up the environment for them a little bit. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Later.